Alrighty, I'm back here again, and uh, this one we're using, it's just a cheap oven cleaner that I picked up at the uh, local supermarket. I've got a couple of cans, this is, I've partly used this one. Um, so, we'll get into it here, and we'll give some of these bits a, a bit of a coating, and um, it's not going to be terribly easy, I might have to try and turn some of them over a little bit, but we'll get into it, and we'll give you a quick shot. This is an old uh, um, outdoor table that the glass broke on. And I was going to make up a wooden top for it, but I haven't got around to it yet. <laughs> so we'll give this a give these a, a dose with this can just to give you a shot of what I'm doing, and then I'll I'll turn them over in bits and pieces and. This can might last too long, but this will give you an idea of what I'm doing anyway. And hopefully if it doesn't rain over the next hour or so, we won't be far away. Now if we can get a couple of hours out of back of rain, like you can see this stuff working already like I don't know if you can see that but it's you know, any of the grease and stuff like it's just sucking up you know and going yellow instantly so I'll give the ends a clean up anyway I can't get that out yeah it's buggered all right I'll turn the camera off and I'll give you a quick shot again in a minute all right we're back so I've flipped most of the stuff over and give it another, you know, good coat on the other side. Try to get in everywhere. So um, you can see, like, it's working already. Really like, all, it's, all the stuff's getting quite yellowy, sort of real browny, dirty sort of colour, like the foam. Like it's, I'm not sure how well it's coming up on the camera. Like it looks okay, but sort of, you know, between naked eye and what's on the camera is always different. So yeah, they're like, that'll be working away nicely. So I'll leave this now for well, as long as I can, hopefully with the weather. And um, I'll give the, the K member a coat too. I'll bring that out in a second and I'll, I'll do that. But I'll, I'll show you the after effect afterwards. Um, I'll just give you a quick shot of it. Like that's the, the underside here now. So you can see all the black paint and everything on it. Um, and that's the other side that's already been sort of been done like that got done when I did the in around most of the engine bay anyway so I'll I'll give this side a light dust with the oven cleaner but I'll, I'll drown the other side to try and get rid of that or get any rid of the last the greasy residue and oil and stuff like that so then it'll be nice and clean for me to um, start doing these texture undercoatings and and nice top coats so they look all nice and, and pretty when I put them back on and hopefully the paint's not going to get knocked off real fast once she starts getting used on the road. Alrighty, we'll see you again shortly. <laughs> 